only one needle. And here's an example. This is a patient with a minoxidil with transcinolol. It's important to feel the resistance. If there is no resistance, then you don't inject because you're probably in a blood vessel. And I usually, um, static, sometimes I use a little bit of a lidocaine just to give a little more comfort. So I start on the back and I move to the front when I'm injecting on the, the vertex. And, and you see, it's really fast when you get the, the feel of how much to inject. To inject usually uh, 0, 0, 0.05 per centimeter or one centimeter and a half, one inch. Um, and then you try to inject more where the patient needs more, right? Um, or where the patient wants more. And here's with um, a larger needle, a 3CC syringe to see how it's also possible to, to use this one. But I'm doing more effort on the thumb. It's not as comfortable for me. Um, and you just introduce the, the very tip of the needle there just to, to be very superficial. So it's a harder technique than using the very sh short needles, which are the four millimeters or the called uh, mesotherapy needles. And this is minoxidil with dutasteride being injected there. And this patient had no anesthetic, uh, not even topical. You know, most patients, they, they talk.